Good morning, Sean and Aaron. Tens of thousands of outages have been reported. Utility officials said crews will work through the day to restore power for all customers. As the Granite State experienced one of the biggest storms in years, we've compiled the following list of helpful resources, power outages, maps, and here's our the power companies in New Hampshire. Just click on what power company you have and it will bring you to that map. If the power goes out, you are encouraged to call your electric provider. Thousands of homes were in the dark along the seacoast and some residents didn't know when they would get their power back. Many who have generators fired them up, but residents Joe Kennedy said he hoped he could flip the lights on without using his generator. Howling pounded Hampton all day, creating dangerous conditions throughout the area. A tree knocked down a fence on Little River Road in Hampton while in Portsmouth a car was crushed by another falling tree. Down power lines created problems while power crews worked on restoration. Utility officials said that wind gusts of 50 miles per hour or more caused issues for tree transmission systems. Utility officials said they are bringing in extra crew, but getting power back could take time. Reporting live here in the WMUR studio, I'm Riley King for WMUR News 9. Sean and Erin, back over to you.